Hey guys, it's Meg. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching. So today I have a really quick office outfit of the day for you guys. I work in a very business casual environment. Um, so if you haven't heard before, I'm a real estate agent, but I'm doing more of a marketing role in my current job right now, which I'm really excited about. I really love doing marketing, social media, all that kind of stuff. Um, so if you do have any questions, all my contact information will be down in the description box below for you guys. Um, I like to do these videos because I like getting ideas and inspiration on how to kind of pair things for the office and I like to get a sense of what other people wear day to day on work. I think it's always good to have new ideas, especially, you know, I feel like it can be, depending on where you work, you know, it can get a little bit like snoozeville trying to think of new outfits to pull together. So this one's really easy, really basic. Um, the, a couple new pieces, a couple old pieces, so I figured I would just hop on here and share with you guys since I'm already dressed. I just got done my day and figured why not turn the camera on and share with you guys what I'm wearing. So I may get a couple questions about my hair. I did just recently cut and color it. I will link a video down below if you guys are interested. I do my hair all the time at home. You might be cringing and say it looks awful or you might be interested to see how I get this look. I have gone darker. A lot of my like most popular videos are from me bleaching and like kind of self balayaging my hair. And my grays were just coming in with a vengeance, so I decided to go darker. This is the third time I've dyed my hair dark. My hair does fade pretty quickly. I'm outside a lot, so hopefully now that we're transitioning into fall, it will last a little bit longer. I won't be in the sun as much. But I get a lot of questions about my cut sometimes. It does look lopsided, but I actually really like kind of the asymmetrical look of it. If I were to flip my hair and do a center part, it's more of a longer angled type of cut so it's you know it's not anything super crazy it just looks a little bit more dramatic when I have my hair flipped to one side which is sometimes how I will wear it so that's why it looks a little bit shorter on the one side because my front pieces are longer than the back pieces so anyway I got really off tangent there let's hop into it makeup is the Lorac Pro palette, the white palette. I love that one. I have on World Lip Liner and a Lorac Gloss. My earrings are from Tory Burch and they are really pretty. It's like a pearl and the little Tory Burch logo and some rhinestones. I love these and I wear them all the time. I think they add just enough sparkle but they're like still very sophisticated and pretty at the same time so I really love those. Necklace is by Sophia jewelry I love this they did send this to me but I've been wearing it non-stop I think the size of it is absolutely perfect watch is old this is my guess it's super old but it's just a good basic classic watch at a really good price point wedding band is from Tiffany's my Jennifer Zuner little nameplate necklace with my daughter's name I have a J Crew top gap pants Tory Burch flats which you guys will see when we back up You guys, so as you can see, this is just a really easy little like sweater. It's very comfortable. I have a bunch with just the crew neck, but I liked this little bow detail. Um, it was really comfortable and just casual enough for a Friday, but not you know too casual. These are the pants that I love. They're from the Gap, and they're a little bit cropped, which if you're on the shorter side, I think is a flattering look. Um, if you are very tall, they might be a little bit too cropped for you. So I will link everything in the description box for you guys. So you can go ahead and check it out, check the sizing charts, and see if you think it'll work for you and your body type. And I just went with classic Tory Burch flats. I really like them. They're super easy, and they're very comfortable. And then my bag, which is such an oldie, I just thought it looked cute with the gray and black, and I literally never wear this, but I have to like lug so much stuff to the office now. Um, and I didn't want to be like using my nicer bags not that this isn't nice But it's older and I can just like fit a lot in it and kind of throw it around I can put my lunchbox my water bottle and I'm not like worried about my water bottle like sweating all over the stuff inside So inside I just have all my work papers my agenda and all that This is by Rebecca Minkoff if they do still have this style in other patterns I will link it for you guys. It's a good tote and it's at another really good price point so it's perfect for work or school and you can kind of just like toss it around. 
So I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing this video. Thank you so much for watching. All of the details will be listed in the description box down below, along with my email and my Instagram, Snapchat, all of that good stuff will also be linked as always. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.